Why is Mercedes considered the better car when Toyota is more reliable? This is like comparing apples to guavas. They're both fruit, but that's about where the similarities end. Why's that? Well, let's break it down. Perception versus practicality. First off, Mercedes has a certain allure wrapped in the luxury and prestige of their brand. You're not just buying a vehicle, you're purchasing a statement piece, a symbol of success, status, and craftsmanship. This is a lineage of German engineering that dates back to the very first car. People often buy into the heritage just as much as they buy the machine itself. Performance and pizzazz. Now let's talk performance. Mercedes is known for a higher-end driving experience, from the feel of Napa leather under your fingertips to the acoustic pleasure of a finely tuned exhaust, they're delivering on an auditory and sensory promise, one that suggests you've made it. All of this is before we even get into the AMG line, where the performance really ratchets up to 11. Innovation and features. In terms of innovation, Mercedes often packs their cars with cutting edge technology. The latest safety features, multimedia systems, and a slew of automated driving assists, Mercedes doesn't scrimp on the sci-fi. Lexicon for this is cutting edge, but the straightforward phrasing is fancy stuff that makes life easier. Now, the reliable workhorse Toyota. On the flip side, Toyota is synonymous with reliability. Your Toyota might not catch jealous glances at the traffic light, but it'll likely get you from A to B for decades with nothing more than oil changes and new tires. Their reputation for dependability isn't a fluke. It's the result of consistent manufacturing quality and design philosophies geared towards longevity, plain and simple. Economical sense Toyotas are practical. They're often more affordable to buy, run, and maintain. When people ask me why I drive, in this case, let's say I'm in Portland, so rain is a constant, a trusty Toyota that can navigate the wet streets without costly repairs gets my vote. The upshot. It's all about what you value. If you're after a mechanical companion that'll go the distance without fuss, Toyota's your sure bet. If you want to make a statement and live life with a bit of flair, Mercedes has the keys to your dream ride. So when you hear, Mercedes is better, pause and consider the context. Better in which ways? It's a subjective measure. What's better for an Autobahn blast might not be better for the reliability required daily drives through Portland's unpredictable weather. And at the end of the day, both companies serve different masters. Mercedes courts the artisan enthusiast, while Toyota courts the steadfast commuter. Both are commendable depending on which road you're taking.